I went into Stonehurst Asylum with fairly high hopes because it's a Victorian lunatic asylum pot boiler based on a story by Edgar Allan Poe, so I thought it might be quite good fun, but ugh, not really in the end. It starts out with Jim Sturgis, a young medical student who arrives at this asylum and he gets taken in by the director, played with the usual relish by Sir Ben Kingsley. He also falls in love with a hysterical woman, played by Kate Beckinsale, which is, well, creepy, but not really in the right way. Before you know it, there's all sorts of uh, classic old-fashioned loonies. A man who thinks he's a horse, women who think they're babies, a giggling man in a jester's hat. But the problem is, this one tries to have its cake and eat it, because at the same time, it says we should try and be a bit more caring and a bit more understanding and have these people in the community. And then next minute, it wheels out an ogre from the cellar. Now, this all sounds like it's quite good fun. And, you know, Michael Caine and Ben Kingsley go through the motions. They're OK. But when the twists come, they're all a bit... Mm, and if at the end of the day it's too long, the dialogue's not very good and it's just all a bit cheap. 